Hi everyone, welcome to the channel Sluggers. I'm Anupam Mishra uh, and I'll provide a more detailed intro introduction about myself as well as the channel towards the end of the session. Uh, right now, let's uh, get into the 11th error type uh, of the series, 50 most essential grammatical errors for the ZAD. See, uh, guys, this is not uh, a random list of 50 most essential errors, uh, essential grammatical errors that we have created. There's a certain process that went behind it. Uh, and uh, for those of you who want to understand uh, what the process was, uh, you can, I've created a different video where I explain that in detail and you can, you can uh, check that video out by clicking on the cue card here on the top. Okay. Okay. All right. Then let's, okay. So let's uh, look into the error type. Now this is one type of error, which is quite frequently, which, which can be quite frequently observed in, uh, the informal usage of the English language, right? For example, if you ask someone, what do you do? What have you, be, uh, like, what have you been up to or what do you do these days? Right? So they might, they often respond with, okay. I'm working at this factory or I'm working with this organization, etc, etc, right? And then for example, the first sentence says, I'm working at the railroads construction site during the weekends. Now, according to formal English, this is not like you would not want to use the ing form of the verb in such cases, right? So, so, so you see, one thing we need to understand is when it comes to the simple tenses, like, like you need to differentiate between regular action and continuing action. Continuing action is the action that is continuing in every moment of that uh situation right for example i'm i'm delivering a, a lecture right now so that is a continuing action but i take lectures that is the regular action that is not uh, i'm taking lectures uh, there is no way to disc, uh, to describe my profession to anyone right uh, so so i'm taking lectures on this right there seems like you're actually doing it every moment uh, every continuing moment right so you need to differentiate between regular action and continuing action and whenever you have the regular action you'd want to keep it simple which means just simple present tense okay so you'd rather want to respond with uh, i work at the railroads construction site during the weekends okay so that would be the correct uh, form of this expression okay now let's uh, try this example by yourself uh, it says uh, question says uh, the sentence says charlie is often committing silly, silly mistakes while solving easy questions right so this by the way is a slightly trickier sentence that we have uh, I've given you here. Uh, let's see if you can uh, point out the errors or the error. Okay, let me in the comment. Let me know in the comment section. Finally, guys, my quick introduction. I'm Anupam Mishra and I'm Lucknow alumnus. Um, I have worked in the past with uh, organizations such as Hotstar, UNICEF, Apollo Taz, IMS, etc. I've also worked uh, with an academy as an educator in the past, uh, recognized by, by their Johnny Ive Award. And uh, these, uh, I was, like I was uh, regarded as uh, uh, one of the top uh, VRC educators that they had. Uh, these are my CAT credentials and Sluggers uh, is basically my uh, endeavor to plug in all the crucial gaps that I believe there are in the test prep industry, uh, industry starting with the CAT exam. Okay, now, yeah, so that's about me. Uh, do move on to the next era. Okay.